today's class we will begin in child's pose. Make yourself cozy. I like to palm into my hands, feel the texture of my mat. You can rock your forehead temple to temple. Snuggle a little bit more into your thighs. Allow your hips to be heavy back towards your heels. Right away, start to breathe differently than you have been all day. For me, that means deepening my breaths. You can start lengthening your inhales and your exhales. And just know that this is a breath practice first and a movement practice second. So see if you can just be right here with your breath. And today we'll be doing lots of breath to movement postures. So beginning to synchronize with our breath on your inhale, shift forward to cow pose. Drop your belly, lift your head, big back bend. Exhale, child's pose, sit your hips back towards your heels. Again, cow slither forward, drop your belly, press into your palms. Exhale, curl and round back to child. Inhale, cow, shift forward. Create a hammock for your heart, roll your shoulders back. Exhale, round your hips back towards your heels. Again, inhale, shift forward, big back bend. And exhale, curl, round back. Inhale, shift forward, last one even deeper. And exhale, round back to child's. This time, shift forward with no back bend. Shift forward again, lower halfway down, baby chaturanga. Inhale, back through tabletop. Exhale, child's pose is where we meet. A few more, inhale, shift forward. Exhale, lower halfway down, baby chaturanga. Inhale, tabletop. Exhale, child's pose. Even more, inhale, tabletop. Exhale, baby chaturanga. Inhale up. Exhale, round back. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, build heat, lower halfway down. Inhale up. Exhale, round back. Inhale, shift forward. This time, extend your right leg back. Maybe you start to pulse on the ball of your foot, stretch your calf. And you can even lift your foot, bend your knee, and invite some circles in your hip socket. Just get the blood flowing in your ankle, your toes, and your hip. Your next inhale, extend your right leg back. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose, sunbird. Inhale, fully extend your leg. Just like before, baby chaturanga, exhale, lower halfway down. Inhale, press up. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose. So alternating between those two. Inhale, extend. Exhale, halfway down, firebird. Few more, inhale up. Exhale, sunbird. Inhale, extend. Exhale, firebird. Inhale, extend. Exhale, curl. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, firebird. Inhale, up. Exhale, curl your knee forward, step your foot forward. Now drop your hips. This time lift your heart, hover lunge, breathe in. Exhale, pyramid pose, straighten both legs off the mat. And if it feels good, you can balance on your right heel. We're gonna take a few breaths, just feathering in and out. Focusing on the stretch in the back of your right leg. On your next inhale, bend into your knee. Set your left knee down. Once again, lift your heart, breathe in. Exhale, step back to high plank. Maybe you even shift forward and back, warm up through your wrists and your ankles. 
and then eventually downward facing dog. Explore length in your hamstrings and your calves. Try to find space from your shoulders and your neck. I even like to shrug them up and down a few times. And your next inhale, roll forward into high plank. Take your time. Exhale, roll it back to down dog. So take two more with your own breath. We're looking for this tidal wave-like action, forward and back. Good, take your last round. All together, let's meet forward into high plank. Shift your shoulders past your wrists. Exhale, slowly lower all the way down to your bellies. Wide cobra arms, crawl your fingertips off to the side, tent them. Your next breath in, lift your heart, wrap your shoulder blades onto your back. Exhale, dip your left shoulder down, roll your right shoulder back. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, dip your right shoulder down, roll your left shoulder back. One more each side, inhale, center. Exhale, left shoulder. Inhale, center. Exhale, right shoulder. Big cobra pose. Inhale, pull your heart through center. Exhale, lower all the way down onto the mat. Walk your hands underneath your shoulders. We'll meet back in child's pose. So all that on the left side. So inhale, tabletop, shift forward. Extend your left leg behind you and maybe find your pulses forward and back. Eventually, you can lift your foot up and invite some creative movement, ankle, toes, knee, and hip. Inhale, extend your left leg straight up behind you. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose, sunbird. Inhale, extend. Exhale, bend down halfway, firebird. So alternating, inhale up. Exhale, curl. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, firebird. Inhale, up. Exhale, sunbird. Inhale. Exhale, firebird. Few more. Inhale, up. Exhale, round. Inhale, extend. Exhale, strengthen. Inhale, up. Exhale, curl in. Inhale, extend your leg. Exhale, firebird. Inhale, press up. Exhale, curl your knee forward. Inhale, lengthen. Now exhale, step your left foot in between your hands. Drop your hips, lift your heart. Big breath in. Pyramid pose, curl your back toes, straighten both legs. Then maybe you come to the heel of your left foot. And just notice the difference between your left and your right leg. No judgment, just noticing. Use your breath to feather in and out of the stretch. On your next inhale, bend your knee, set it down, lift your heart, big breath in, exhale, high plank. Now inhale, shift forward, Exhale, take your time, slowly lower all the way down to your belly. Good, stay strong, slowly press back up to your high plank, slower, slower, slow press all the way up. Good, one more, slow lower all the way down. Take your time. See if you can lower your hips, your shoulders, same time. Last time, slowly press all the way up. One straight line. Back down, slow lower for five. Four, three, two, one. Cobra pose. Inhale, tense your fingers, lift your heart up. Option one, stay. Option two, float your hands off the ground. Option three, locust pose. Lift your feet, swim your arms back. Maybe even interlace your hands behind your back. Now lift everything up. Squeeze your shoulders. Send your knuckles straight back. Hold for three. Lift higher. Squeeze tighter, two, a little bit higher than that, and then one, softly release all the way down. You can bend your knees, windshield wiper, to release your back. And 
and set your feet down. Walk your hands underneath your shoulders, curl your toes, and now slowly press all the way up high plank. Downward facing dog, slide your tailbone up and back. Settle into your breath. Settle into the pose. Now inhale, lift your heels, take your eyes forward, and now slowly tippy-toe your feet to the top of your mat. Come to a forward fold, soften your knees. I'd mean, like to interlace my hands behind my neck, create a traction in your cervical spine. Maybe find some sway side to side, release into your hamstrings. Release your hands down. Inhale, flat back, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, fold forward. Take your forehead towards your shins. Now reverse swan dive. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart center. Samasti tihi. Inhale, reach your arms up. Urdhva Hastasana. Exhale, forward fold. Uttanasana. Inhale, flat back. Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, step back to high plank. Good, you can always go back to down dog or with me, shift forward an inch. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, hug your ankles in, roll your shoulders back. Exhale, down dog, press your belly back towards your thighs. Inhale, lift your right leg up to the sky. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose, round your back, just like we did earlier. Inhale, extend your right leg all the way up and back. Again, curl your knee to your nose, press down into your palms. Inhale, extend, three-legged dog. For the last time, curl your knee to your nose. Make this tight little ball away from your mat. Inhale, three-legged dog, fully stretch out your right leg. Exhale, step your right foot in between your hands. Set your left knee down. Inhale, reach your arms up for Anjani Asana. Every inhale, reach up and back. Every exhale, send your hips down and forward. Good, use your breath to pulse in and out. Now keeping your back toes curled, take one more inhale. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your back knee, fly your arms onto your back. Set your knee down, inhale, Anjani. Reach your arms back up, maybe even lean back. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your knee, draw your arms back. One more, set your knee down, inhale, Anjani Asana. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your knee, fly your arms back. High lunge, inhale, keep your knee lifted, reach your arms up. And then find pulses in and out to find your stance. Spike your left heel. Think about growing five inches on the sides of your waist. Take one more big breath in. Exhale, flying cat. Curl your knee to your forehead. Fly your arms back behind you. See if you can go for contact. Again, high lunge. Step back. Reach your arms up. Exhale, flying cat. Curl your left knee to your forehead. Fly your arms back. One more, inhale, reach up. Exhale, flying cat. Let's hold this one. Lift your knee up a little bit higher. Lift the backs of your hands up a little bit higher. High lunge, anticipate your landing. Reach your arms up. Exhale, low lunge, bring your hands down. Inhale, high plank or three-legged plank. Exhale, vinyasa or skip it. Downward facing dog is where we'll meet. Inhale, lift your left leg up to the sky. So same thing on the other leg. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose. Lift your thigh all the way up into your belly. Inhale, extend your left leg, three-legged dog. Exhale, curl your knee to your nose. Press down with your palms. One more. Inhale, extend. Exhale, curl in. Give your knee a big kiss. Inhale, three-legged dog, stretch out your leg. 
Exhale, step your left foot in between your hands. Set your knee down on Johnny. Inhale, reach your arms up. Find your pulses forward and back. Find a stretch in your right hip flexor, but strength lifting up out of your hips. So take one more inhale, curl your back toes. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your back knee, fly your arms back. Hug in towards your midline. Two more, inhale, set your knee down, reach your arms up, maybe lean back. Exhale, airplane lunge, squeeze your shoulders, squeeze your pinkies. Last time, inhale, reach up and back, big breath in. Exhale, airplane lunge, ignite off the mat. High crescent, inhale, reach your arms up. Good, find steadiness in your stance. So this time your knee stays lifted, square both hips forward, and get really tall through the sides of your waist. Good, one more big breath in. Exhale, flying cat, curl your right knee to your forehead, balance, lift the backs of your hands behind you. Two more like that, inhale, high lunge, reach up, gaze up. Exhale, flying cat, round your back and curl. One more, inhale, step back, reach your arms up. Exhale, flying cat. How high can you lift up the backs of your hands? Take your time, touch your knee to your forehead. High lunge, inhale, reach up. Exhale, meet me in downward facing dog. So these in-between vinyasas are 100% optional. And the purpose of them is to create heat. So if you're already feeling warm, then maybe you just meet me here in down dog. Inhale, lift your right leg. Exhale, this time take your right knee to your right armpit. Shift forward as far as you can, then continue to lift. Good, inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, cross your right knee to your left armpit. Lift up, shift forward. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step your right foot in between your hands. Same as before, lower your knee, inhale, reach your arms up, just once this time. Exhale, airplane lunge, lift your knee, draw your arms back. Inhale, high lunge, reach your arms up. Exhale, flying cat, just once, curl your knee to your forehead, draw your arms back. High lunge, inhale, step back, reach your arms up. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. I want you to imagine your hands were arrows. I want you to shoot your arrow forward into diagonal lunge. Lift your biceps up and reach as far as you can. Breathe in. Now as if your right hand was drawing a bow, pull it back. Use it to twist your shoulder back and now come to an open twist. Exalted warrior, take your right hand to your back leg. Reach your left arm up to the sky. See if you can lunge deeper into your right knee. Big breath in. Exhale, drag and twist. Set your left hand down. Reach your right arm up. Two more. Inhale, exalted warrior. Take your right hand to your back leg. Inhale, reach your left arm up. Exhale, drag and twist. Set your left hand down. Reach your right arm up. So move slowly here. One more. Inhale, exalted warrior. Squeeze your thighs. Rise up. Exhale, drag and twist. Set your left hand down. Reach your right arm up. Inhale, exalted warrior, your deepest one yet. Press your leg into your right hand. Big breath in. Exhale, vinyasa or skip it. These chaturangas are 100% optional. And we'll meet back in downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg up to the sky. Exhale, take your left knee to your left armpit. Squeeze in, rise up. Inhale, extend your left leg, three-legged dog. Exhale, cross it to your right armpit. Don't just settle for the elbow, lift it all the way up. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step your left foot forward. Set your knee down. Inhale, Anjani. Reach your arms up. 
Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your knee, fly your arms back. Inhale, high lunge. Reach your arms up. Exhale, flying cat. Curl your right knee to your forehead. Balance. Inhale, high lunge. Synchronize the movements. Reach your arms up. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. Inhale, shoot your arrow forward into your diagonal lunge. Reach as far forward as you can. Left hand draws the bow back and then find a big twist. Pull your arms back behind you. Exalted warrior, swim your left arm to your right leg. Now reach your right arm back. Big breath in. Drag and twist. Set your right palm down. Reach your left arm up. Two more. Inhale, squeeze to rise steady. Inhale, reach your right arm up. Exhale, drag and twist. Set your right hand down. Lift your left arm up. One more full round slowly. Inhale, rise up, exalted warrior. Exhale, drag and twist. Right hand down, left arm up. Slow rise. Inhale, exalted warrior. Make this your deepest one yet. Lunge into your left knee. Reach your right arm back even further. Exhale, chaturanga or skip it. Let's meet back in downward facing dog. Now we're going to flow by what we already know. And I'm going to add on one more time. So inhale, lift your right leg up to the sky. Exhale, cross your right knee to your left armpit. This time, fall in triangle. Extend your right leg. Inhale, reach your left arm up. Push the ground away. Think about shooting laser beams out of your left hand. Good. Take one more big breath in. Exhale, sit your hips straight down. Keep your left arm up. Now, slice your left hand all the way off to the left. Press into your palm. Inhale, lift your hips up. Big stretch. Exhale, sit your hips back down. Take both hands over to the right side, back onto your mat. Press into your palms. Inhale, three-legged dog. Send your right leg up. Option one, stay. Option two, bend your knee, open your hip. Option three, wild thing. Step your right foot behind your left leg. Now lift up your belly. Good. Think about resisting the ground away from you. Now wherever you are, gaze down. Inhale, lift your right knee up to the sky. Exhale, as slow as you can, step it to the top of your mat. Set your knee down. Inhale, Anjani, reach your arms up. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your knee, draw your arms back. High lunge. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, flying cat. Curl your knee to your forehead. Inhale, high lunge. Step back, reach up. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. Inhale, shoot your arrow forward. Exhale, right hand draws the bow back, big twist. Exalted warrior, inhale, reach your left arm up. Exhale, drag and twist. Set your left hand down, reach your right arm up. One more, inhale, exalted. Reach your left arm up to the sky. Here's the change. Warrior two, exhale, open to the left. Good. Take some time to find your stance. Surf it in and out. Make sure your chest is square to the side wall. Take your gaze fierce over your right middle finger. Make sure you're level over your hips. If you'd like more challenge, you can lift up your right heel and find more depth in your right leg. Three big breaths. Inhale, peaceful warrior, reach your right arm back. Maybe even grab on with your left hand and then pull your wrist to the back. Press your shin away from your arm, breathe in. Exhale, vinyasa or skip it. Maybe you take another chaturanga. Downward facing dog is our end goal. Inhale, lift your left leg up to the sky. Exhale, cross your left knee to your right armpit. Fall in triangle, extend your left leg. Inhale, reach your left arm up. 
Imagine a flame underneath your hips. Push away from the ground. Good, take one more big inhale. Exhale, sit your hips down onto the ground. Take your right hand all the way to the right. Press into your palm. Inhale, lift your hips up. Big stretch. Exhale, sit both hips down. Take both hands over to the left. Plant both palms. Now lift your left leg up and back. Three-legged dog. Option one, stay. Option two, bend your knee. Option three, wild thing. From your wild thing, think about not just opening your hips up to the sky, but your chest as well. If you're in wild thing, gaze down at your hand. Inhale, lift your left knee. Exhale, step your left foot to the top. Set your right knee down. Inhale, Anjani, reach both arms up. Exhale, airplane lunge. Lift your knee, draw your arms back. High lunge, inhale. Flying cat, exhale, balance. Inhale, high lunge, anticipate the movement. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. Inhale, shoot your arrow forward, diagonal lunge. Exhale, left hand draws the bow back, big twist. Exalted, inhale, swim your right arm up. Exhale, drag and twist, set your right hand down, reach your left arm up. Exalted warrior, inhale, reach your right arm high. The change is warrior two, exhale, open to the left. Cut. Find your stance. Notice how this might feel different on the left leg. If you'd like some more spice, consider lifting your left heel, pressing your left shin bone a little bit more forward. Use your breath and find steadiness and ease in the pose. Peaceful warrior, inhale, reach your left arm back. Maybe grab on with your right wrist, pull it back for the big side stretch. Exhale, cartwheel both hands down, and then you choose. You can take chaturanga, up dog, down dog, or maybe we decided to skip those all together. So that's all our whole sequence. Let's flow through it. Inhale, lift your right leg, three-legged dog. Exhale, cross your right knee to your left armpit. Fall in triangle. Inhale, stretch your left arm up. Exhale, sit your hips down. Slice your left hand off to the left. Press up. Inhale, lift your hips. Exhale, sit it down. Take both hands over to the right. Lift your right leg. Inhale, three-legged dog. Option one, stay. Option two, exhale, wild thing. All together, inhale, lift your right knee up to the sky. Exhale, step your right foot to the top. Set your left knee down. Inhale, Anjani, reach both arms up. Exhale, airplane lunge, lift your back knee, fly your arms. Inhale, high lunge, reach up. Exhale, flying cat. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. Inhale, shoot your arrow forward. Exhale, right hand draws the bow back. Exalted, inhale, reach your left arm up. Exhale, drag and twist or warrior two, open up. Inhale, peaceful warrior, reach back, maybe grab onto your wrist. Exhale, low lunge. High plank, breathe in. Chaturanga, breathe out. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Last time, inhale, lift your left leg. Exhale, cross it to the right. Fall in triangle. Inhale, extend your arm up. Exhale, sit your hips down. Take your right arm off to the right. Inhale, lift your hips, big stretch. Exhale, set your hips down. Both hands over to the left. Inhale, lift your left leg, three-legged dog. Exhale, stay or wild thing. 
Inhale, lift your left knee up. Exhale, step your left foot forward. Set your right knee down. Inhale, Anjani, breathe in. Exhale, airplane lunge. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, flying cat. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, draw your thumbs to your heart. Inhale, shoot your arrow forward. Exhale, left hand draws the bow back, twist. Exalted, inhale. Drag and twist, right hand down, exhale. Inhale, exalted, power up. Exhale, warrior two, open up. Peaceful, inhale, maybe grab onto your left wrist, big stretch. Exhale, here's your last opportunity for vinyasa. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Up dog, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. Inhale, lift your heels, take your eyes forward. Exhale, step or jump your feet forward. Now bend your knees deeply, half lift. Sit back onto your booty and then we'll lift up to boat pose. So you wanna make sure that you're not on your tailbone here, but more forward. You can measure that by drawing your thighs to your belly. Big inhale, good low boat on your exhale, wrap your shoulders back, good. Now I want you to rock onto your left butt cheek, take your arms over to the right. Take a deep breath in, exhale, lift up, crunch your knees to your left armpit. A few more, inhale, lower, exhale, shoot, crunch. Again, inhale, lower, exhale, crunch. Inhale, lower, exhale, crunch. Inhale, and exhale, crunch. Good, inhale, lower, last time, exhale, crunch. Lower, now rock onto your right butt cheek, take your arms over to the left, breathe in, exhale, crunch your knees to your right armpit. Inhale, lower, exhale, crunch. Inhale, lower, exhale, crunch. Again, inhale, exhale, crunch. Inhale, lower, exhale, crunch. Inhale, lower through center, pedal your feet for five, four, three, feel the burn, two, and one. Lower all the way down. Whew. Take a big morning stretch, arch your back, spread your toes, and then bend your knees, hug them in towards your belly. Maybe find some circular pressure on your low back. Set the soles of your feet down onto the ground. We'll take figure four, cross your right ankle over your left knee. Flex your right foot. Use your right hand to square your shin forward. And option one, you can stay. Or option two, draw your left knee in towards your chest. Either way, make sure your shoulder blades are relaxed down onto the mat. Press your low back into the mat. And every inhale, press your right ankle against your left knee. Every exhale, pull your left knee in a little bit closer. Good, five full breaths. Wherever you are, set your left foot back down. Place your hands by your hips. Figure four bridge, inhale, lift your hips up. Square your right knee to the right corner of the room. Interlace your hands underneath you. Now draw your right knee into your chest. Extend your right leg straight up. Good, push into your left heel, hold for three. Lift, 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 two, lift a little bit higher. And one, set your hips back down onto the ground. Keep your right leg straight. Interlace your hands behind your leg, pull it in a few times. With a straight leg, lower it down. Draw your left knee into your chest. 
Take your right hand across your left knee, big twist. Cross your right knee all the way over. Draw your knee back through center. We'll take it to the other side. Cross your left ankle over your right knee. Flex your foot. Square your shin. Maybe you stay. Or maybe you interlace your hands behind your right leg and pull your knee in towards your chest. Do your best to relax your shoulders and your low back. You can use your breath to feather in and out. And if it's too much, it's a good sign to back off. And if it's too little, go deeper. But once you have found your sweet spot, see if you can just hold it right there and breathe into your left hip. Set your right foot down, keep your figure four. Figure four bridge, press into your palms. Inhale, lift your hips up. Good, interlace your hands behind you. Square your left knee. Once you can't lift up any higher, draw your left knee into your chest, then extend your left foot up. Keep lifting, lifting, lifting for three. Keep pointing your toe, lift a little higher, two. And then one, lower your hips all the way back down to the ground. Keep your left leg straight, pull it in a few times, stretch in your hamstring. And with a straight left leg, lower it all the way down to the ground. Draw your right knee into your chest. Take your left hand across your right knee, big twist. Draw your right knee all the way off to the left. Take your right cheek to the mat to deepen the twist. We have time for one more back bend. Come back through center, bend your knees. Option one, you can take a double leg bridge, press into your palms. Option two, wheel pose if you feel ready. Take your hands to frame your ears. Make sure your feet are center. Press into your palms, lift your hips. Hug your elbows in and then lift up to your wheel. And not only are we lifting up, we wanna press back as well. So bring your legs into the party. Good, bring your quads into the party. Think about sending your chest through your arms, three deep breaths. To release, lift your heels, tuck your chin to your chest and slowly lower down all the way, one vertebra at a time. Instead of drawing your knees into your chest, widen your feet, knock your knees in, swish them side to side to release your low back. The next time your knees are over to the right, pause there. Cross your right ankle on top of your left knee, squeeze your left butt cheek and arch your back. Uncross, inhale your knees through center, Drop them to the left. Cross your left ankle on top of your right knee. Now squeeze your right butt cheek, arch your back. Now that we neutralize, go ahead, draw your knees back up and then pull them in one final last squeeze. Give each knee a kiss. Finally, releasing down into our final Shavasana. Pick up your chest, slide your shoulder blades down your back. 
Take up space, open your arms, open your legs. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Open mouth, let it go. And for the next few moments, watch the rise and fall of your breath. And you can be here as long as you like. This is where I leave you. Thanks for practicing with me this morning.